Greetings there, Swarmlings, Rodamon here. Thank you for tuning in to Stellaris Co-op Beta, Episode 6, Revisionist. Yeah, but like, I definitely I'm, clicked all of the like co-op empire allow co-op checkboxes this time around. I'll be honest, man. Even with the hiccups and stuff, I'm not having a bad time. I'm thoroughly enjoying this and having fun. The cloud must grow. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I mean, in 80 years, we've taken over like a quarter of the galaxy. Dude, we have done so good. much. Can you imagine if humankind was this way? Uh... The Imperium not, of Man? Not <laughs> like... <laughs> That's fair. Alright, I'm the right people this time. Okay, cool. Alright, that... Okay, right. I see the organism... You made a choice there? Yeah, so I'm trying to pull up... Other but one. this menu doesn't Station seem to have... I don't think you're going to be able to close this one. Yeah, is is it... Uh, I don't even... There's no Todd of the last bowl. Let's see. The The only thing I can think of for this is to do, make complete. further investigation into Spaceport them lost. and then to trigger, like, the Gasoline next stage. Station. That would be the only, only thing that comes to mind for me. We could... We could try it and just see what happens. Yeah. Because. Yeah, I can't. Hmm. Very interesting. Station under attack. All right, so I just unlocked the project to unlock their like dive deeper into their secrets. And I'm queuing that okay. up now in hopes that it will get rid of this. Screen. Perfect. Battling aggressor station. I'll just put this screen, uh, you know, nowhere. nowhere good to put it. I was like, you know, in the best possible place, right? Yeah, I'll, I'll put it in the way because <laughs> there's like, what no you, other please. choice. What are you going to do, right? Yeah. Hey, someone got conquered. It wasn't even us doing it. Not, you know, soon. My son, soon. Aggressor soldiers uh, landing. Oh, it's like something out of a nightmare. Mutated creatures attacking our people. Sounds um, hot. <laughs> it is pretty warm. All right, okay, desync. I'm getting desyncing. Yeah, uh, the game's. Uh, the game, I Colony think we've grown <laughs> too far. Space so mutants lost. are now overrunning. Oh God! Mintoc yeah. Prime. I see that. It's overrun by deformed creatures. <laughs> <laughs> well, at Mintog, I could just create <laughs> a ship to go over there. What a bizarre area. Station There's so attack. much. Yeah, what are you supposed to do with that? I have your screen up. Yeah, I, 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 I don't know. It's just juggling it around out of the way is more or less the only option the I have. The only option? There might be like um here, let me Google. Uh Spaceport let's lost. Put that in there. Salvage preserved. I guess what I'll do is I'll just wait. Battling aggressor station. Station under for attack. the that chain was it. to progress. Okay. Yeah, it was that part of the chain. But it's not opening up a new menu item. Aggressors spotted. So, I hear all that four works. <laughs> it does, but not so much in that way. Not the way we want it to work. Battling aggressor station. Okay. I'm having to make the... Okay, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to turn this other flute around. So, again, more of the two-front war attack. problems. Yeah. No, I understand. Aggressor station. And also, I'm playing with, like, 
with one eye poked out. A real disadvantage, some might say. Why are those high? Are those, yeah, yeah, those are high. Li- those areas are high lit yellow. Oh, because they have uh, hyper lanes. Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. Spaceport lost. So I'm having another fleet double back to fix that Bat situation. Station. I understand. Station under attack. Some noises. It's <laughs> <laughs> just so much going on. Lost. Research complete. Spaceport under attack. Battling aggressor station. Interesting. Spaceport lost. So I think the further insight dead ended, if I'm not mistaken. Meaning that that's not going to really help me out much. We're not dead ended, but like we finished. Yeah. Under attack. I think you're correct. All right, I I've run into this problem before, where you have to use like console commands to close I'm, parts of quests. I'm okay but it's with that. Kind of annoying to have to manage while playing, especially yeah. while hosting, because it would require me to like boot out. But uh, I'll try to Google it on while on the side while like Space running in under attack. a war. I will also attempt to help you out. Let's see. Station uh. under attack. Spaceport lost. Oh, okay. They have two fleets. One of the fleets complete. is about to get smushed now. Gotcha. You handle that. I'll, I'll, I'm doing the Google real quick. Spaceport lost. Battling aggressor station. Died there. Admiral. Construction complete. Uh, spotted. It says turn on online save and turn Station off pop up events is an option. And quit and reload. For what? It'll to have to be more. Disable that. It says turn on an online save, then turn off pop up events. Uh, quit and reload the game, but I don't know if turning off pop up events is an option for us with this beta branch. Yeah, what I'm so the way to do this normally, because I've had this bug out once before, is you have to like turn on debug tooltips. Mm-hmm. Oops. And uh, and then like put in the command codes for forcing activated. the quest line to resolve itself. Research complete. Um, but that's going to take me kind of. Yeah, it's not a quick thing. Blocker cleared. Uh. I can try to do it, but that gives you, you know, that will force you to like twiddle your thumbs a while, which is unfortunate. I mean, I'm I'm okay with it, man. I'd rather you be able to play optimally. Okay. Than yeah, like, we, I'll, yeah, I'll try. I'll try to do it quickly. It uh, doesn't. No, 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 man. Like, it doesn't seem like it would be fun doing what you're doing with a so, giant, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> uncollapsible screen. Yeah. Well, we we can just shoot the breeze while I I troubleshoot this. How's that sound? Yeah, that works. And also, I'll put up a poll for this. The Hidden Worlds. What option do we choose? All right. Yeah. Oh, but anyway. Yeah, while we're out of months doing that, I want to say uh, thanks. Thanks for uh, for hanging out with us. Thanks for coming in, playing, and or uh, enjoying our little, our little banter here as we 
kind of go back and forth uh, at each other and the game, obviously. The real enemy of everything, the game. <laughs> yeah. But uh, thanks, everybody. Let's see. Do I want to save or do I want to quit? I'll just quit. I'll finish that poll since I can't make a decision right now. Oh, excuse me. Stop playing a game for a second. Start yawning the way the world was. <laughs> right, I'm first seeing if just like rebooting the game will fix it. And if that doesn't, then I'll have to yeah. use some console commands to debug it. There's also. Ooh. Yep. Just did, did it fix it? Yeah, just go in. Oops. Uh, uh, okay, there we go. Just go into menu. Nice. Kicking all the way out of the game. All right. Well, uh, okay. Let me host then. Then. Look at that. Gotta love it. Easy fixes. And then I said uh, thanks to everybody too, so we made everybody feel happy about life. Like we're just good people, really. <laughs> all right. Well, you load in. I'm gonna run to the bathroom. You should probably. Oh wait, walk. no. Nope, nope. So wait, this oh. is so strange. It worked in yeah. single player, but not in multiplayer. Well, I'm so confused. Here, let me. What, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna play yeah. like an extra day on single. No, even in the single player, it's broken again. What happened? <laughs> this is so confusing. <laughs> the bad luck. Yeah, I don't. Let me try one more time. Yeah, this is strange. I can try older saves too, because I have a ton of like auto saves. So I'm gonna start going back through the auto save save uh, queue, which would not lose us a lot of time, hopefully. That's all right. Well, then we also know what's gonna happen. So we're basically like you know, Terminators, Terminator. You got beta ban beta beta branch, but dude, you can't use alliteration. That's not how life works. Oh no, it looks like no matter what the auto saves, unless I'm willing to go way back. How far is this? This is about as far as I'd want to go back. <laughs> and it still is there. Okay. You guys know that I can't talk good. Come on now. Gosh. So if I go all the way back to... If I go back... Eight years, it's fine. I mean... <laughs> is that fine for you? Yeah, I'm fine. Dude, I am pretty easy it's probably, going. To be fair, I think it's probably faster for me to do that than... Trying to fix it? Yeah. Yeah, than trying to fix it. And good to know that it uh, can blow up like that. Yeah, things happen. Man, I am. I have not been sleeping. <laughs> I shouldn't complain to you about not sleeping well. <laughs> you, I mean, you can complain. No, uh, no it just I'm means not even, that I'm I gonna, can sympathize like you would not believe. I want to take my foot right out my mouth and just say, "I understand." No, bad what you're sleep going is to. bad sleep, no matter no matter what. Man, we got a, a construction site across the street, and they left on an industrial strength generator over the weekend. It is not fun. Oof. Uh, did you get that invite? I did. I just got it. Okay. I'll be back in just a second. Good luck. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is what you guys got to deal with. Wait. Hang on. I got I to gotta see if you guys can still hear me. All right. You can still hear me. So I can basically say whatever I want now. Hello. My name is Rodamont. And today... We're going to play Stellaris in RimWorld a little bit later. Then we're going to get the Wendigos out. After we get the Wendigos out, we're going to play some Project Zomboid. <laughs> we're living in the future in Project Zomboid. It's a cold winter. You know... Developers of RimWorld have reached out to me, and they've they've asked my opinion. Oh, you're right. I'm sorry. 
Hi, everybody. Radamont here. And today, we're going to relax and play some Stellaris. Okay. You know, oh, oh <clears throat> yeah, yeah. My ears were burning, so I, I came back quickly. <laughs> <laughs> I just said, hey, everybody, Radamon here. <laughs> All right. Are you are you ready? <laughs> I was born ready, baby. Perfect. Oh, man. I was just saying how we're going to play some Wendigos later, probably. Research complete. And, then, <laughs> and after that, you know. Sus. Nice. <laughs> Way too sus. Well, I apparently spoke too fast. Oh, well, that's, okay. that's the Best thing that, that it was the giveaway. I killed it. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's see. That's right. Okay, so we're taking over the great sleeper. Perfect. Great sleepers ours. Let's get uh let's get our So now I can just correct all of the mistakes I made. Yeah, yeah, easy. Yeah. Although, you know, honestly, some of those mistakes when you have like a like a quarter or a third of your screen covered up, it's hard to fight a battle like like with that much of your screen monopolized by bugs. Yeah. So I, I couldn't really tell what was going on. I had some blind spots simply because there was a giant. I I don't pop blame up. you for anything. <laughs> giant pop up I couldn't dismiss. <laughs> I I blame chat for not That's helping us out. Station. Honestly. Research. <laughs> oh, 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 shots fired at chat. <laughs> uh. Research complete. Chat, he's Research talking about your, your his chat, not my chat. My chat, I I, I wouldn't... Uh, Obviously. Yeah. My chat riots if I just say hello the wrong way. So We have a new admiral because uh, Guitar Lillian said I should, and I agree this time, knowing that we are going to be in a three-front war. Aggressors <laughs> spotted. How do oh. I know that? Oh, I you don't know. know. I could tell the Magic. Future. Good times were had by most. Research complete. Okay, so, the so I'm going to leave the Gowl quest line alone because mm -hmm. it was like the herpes of quest lines. And <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to experience that again. Oh, man. Uh, Fleeing good, aggressors. Good times. Good times. All right. Oh, no. Yeah, they have a little fleet dancing around. It's fine. Space I'm already preparing for them. Spaceport lost. What's interesting is like going into this, we had the idea of the division of labor, and like now having played it a bit, you absolutely need to divide labor, or the game yeah. like explodes violently in your face in a laughable there's, way. There's no way. I don't think I would be able to play this by myself. Well, also, what I mean is, like, if we both try to do the same thing. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We would that's just... when it, like, bugs out most. So the division of labor is, like, required. Battling aggressor station. Spaceborne life form encountered. Prime. This is good. We have, uh. All right. I'm going to do our envoys. No, never mind. We don't have envoys. That we need to mess with. That's right. That was in a previous, existence. a previous world. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, what did I do to this world? Battling aggressor station. That up there. That's Salvage fine. preserved. I'm not sure if we're gonna win this naval battle. We'll we'll see. We. I think we we could, but I don't know. I have the faith in you. Battle commenced. Thank you. You're welcome. At Pulvis. Research complete. Not. They outnumbered us. I wasn't able to build up a fleet 
strong enough. The station might take them out, though. Construction complete. Uh, do you need more naval? Or are you good with that? 205? Um, 205's good for now. Okay. Edicts, then. Fleet lost. Right, we'll continue. We'll finish up the ions. It'll take but a minute. Then we got research complexes, because I'm going to turn Grekel into a uh, research place. Research complete. That's what we no, call actually, this. No, we, we did win. Oh, yeah, or, yeah. We're going to. Nice. Yep, they're, they're gone. Oh, Desync. debug. Yep. Desync. I'm just going to unpause it and hope it doesn't. Uh... Well, it should. It should Salvage be fine. Preserved. Yeah, there we go. Cool, they held the line. Complete. Construction complete. Nice, nice. All the stuff, all of the things. Upgrade all them ships, baby. Spaceborne life form encountered. Pew pew. Yeah, the division of labor is was very, very much needed. It just yeah, there'd be too much happening otherwise. Battling aggressor station. Fleeing aggressors. Well, this is going well. Uh, Are you? How's your desync? Is it? Uh, it's pretty good. I'm not. I'm not having any issues. Okay. That's good to hear. Battling aggressor station. Might be one of those warnings where it's just like, oh, it needs to catch up. You know, it's not. Yeah. The alarm yeah. bells, really. Well, what I will say is this version of history is, uh, <laughs> I like it better. Better without for us. A giant pop up block in my view and us losing territory as a result. This seems to be better. Battling aggressor station. Well, if you're happy, I'm happy. Good. I am happy. Happy to be I'm playing with you. You know what? Same Z's, dude. Same Z's. Oops, I cut your empire in half. Oops, I did it again. Played with your heart. Oh, there's a tomb world up there, too. Battling aggressor station. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Yeah. Spaceborne life form encounter. Oh, uh, what planet is this? This is... All right, good news. The undesirables are being eaten at a fast enough pace that there's not going to be a riot. Ships upgraded. <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> Sometimes <laughs> that's what you got to do to prevent riots Salvage in the streets. Preserved. Eat them quicker. That's that's what we do. Wormhole travel, wormhole travel. All right, sounds cool. good. Is that what yeah. you're getting? Nice, because we have a bunch of wormholes now. Yeah. yeah. Just send our ships in there and just be like, hello. Greetings. <laughs> We've come to the bar to try your local cuisine. All right. Uh, I need to continue. Let's upgrade buildings. Upgrade buildings. All right. This is what I like to see. Let's turn them minerals into Definitely research points, station. baby. Awesome. Research yeah. complete. Hmm. Let's get a faculty of studies. Yeah, yeah. Let's study things. Man, all our research is just straight purples. 
Fletchling Aggressor Station. I'm not touching the archaeology side events anymore. I learned my lesson, so uh, if there okay. is progress there, I will leave it to you. <laughs> As I'm scared. That's, I'm not that's... scared of the galaxy ganging up on me. I'm scared of a little research, <laughs> a little progress. It's the brains of the situation. Battling aggressor station. All right. Spaceborne life form encountered. That's Battling a lot of stuff station. happening. Enjoy soft husk. Uh, why is some of the territory going to Fog of War? Um, I don't know what you mean by that. You I mean don't... like the centerpieces that we haven't taken some? The unsurveyed right. areas? System survey complete. Like one of them has a dimensional horror in there, so we're gonna <laughs> not, not go there at the moment. In fact, what I could do is I can, um... I can forbid uh, our ships from entering those station. sectors. So that we don't trip into there and get ourselves annihilated. Battle commenced. Uh, resources from jobs, 5%. We'll take that. Dude, that'll bump everything up very nicely. Complete. Envoy Battling talk, we got station. you. Salvage preserved. Oh, did I change? Did I change the edicts? Is that the... Uh, is this timeline? It was this timeline. That's fine. Battling aggressor station. Just to the right of the two enclaves? These? Here? Uh, we haven't. It's because uh, we haven't made first contact. They're yeah, like an we, unknown sieve. There, we haven't been through there, but we know that they exist and we want to kill them. Eat them. Yep. Basically. <laughs> Sounds about right. Wow. Uh, tells Leb that the capital of the people we're killing is the Zizeb. <laughs> good job, Zleb. Salvage preserved. Agricultural world. We're doing good with Aggie. Let's put. Sorry, I sometimes have talked to myself. Oh, it's fine. It helps me keep up to date of what you're doing anyway, so it's perfect. All right. Well, I'm switching over the uh, the generator world into Gasoline a research world. Station. Okay. And yeah, uh, right now all of our science ships have stuff that they're doing, but as soon as any yeah. of them idle is idle, they can go and commence. assist research. Yeah, and I figured I figured attack. that you know at that point we'll be good. Handshake protocols activated. Okay, so Handshake we got the protocols. Year Handshake warning. Station. Got it. I will eat as much as I can in the next two years. You know what I always say? Nom nom nom. Salvage preserved. Battle commenced. Well, I am nomming fast. Take that. Invasion begun. <laughs> Battling aggressor station. Whoever uh, you were trying to make first contact with, um, mm -hmm. I just they can talk nuked them talk without <laughs> saying hi. I have zero problems with this. Battling aggressor station. It's like, who are you? Uh, don't care. Gonna kill you. Preserved. All right, and then demolishing one of the water worlds that we just capped because we're never going to use that. Yeah. Or maybe not never, but he's to terraform first. Yeah. And, and who's got time for that, really? So we are hemorrhaging money at the moment. I will fix that. It's not too bad. Space it's not green. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> Oh, anomaly. Wow. All right. Spaceport lost. I don't know where this fleet came from. I'm dealing with it. I have a fleet inbound to deal with the fleet that, like, appeared out of nowhere. I think they maybe wormhold. Oh, they must have wormhold. We just yeah. unlocked wormhold technology as well, so. Okay. That's yeah, I, I, I think they wormhold into Karenval in the northwest, and that's why I didn't 
see them coming because they weren't there a minute ago. I mean, that, that checks out. Yeah. So if you're wondering why we're losing territory in the northwest, it's because a fleet appeared out of nowhere. Sometimes deal fleets, with it. fleets be doing that, you know? I don't know. It's so rude. But Anomaly found. definitely working on it now. Battling aggressor station. I like how there's like pop-ups of piracy occurring, and I'm just like, yeah. <laughs> Pirates. <laughs> it's not something we really need to worry about. No. No. We don't we don't trade. We only trade in corpses. The so if they want to talk. An enemy. That's why I always send my envoy, uh my envoy soft husk. <laughs> First off, that name is amazing. But secondly, we just want them to know that we trade in corpses. I would say conservatively, we're like easily a third of the galaxy now. Uh, I would, yeah, I would say we're more than that. But yeah, yeah, that sounds about right. Oh, one thing I didn't do is break down Great Sleeper. Um. I was, uh, I broke down Space some of their, their buildings. Because there's a ton of things that you might want to just, like, break station. up, because we're not it, you know, using activated. it okay. for anything. You don't have to. I was just, it's a complete. very developed world with no one to work those developments, essentially. Yeah, that's, that's the issue we're running into, and our population just keeps dwindling, because, you know, we're So eating. for those, those types of developments, you end up uh, paying for them. In terms of um, Battle commenced. empire size, like it slows down our research and uh, tradition unlocks. So you want to have planets as with as little infrastructure essentially as possible in order to gotcha. develop as fast as possible. Station. Research complete. Gotcha. Like worlds that have tons of empty jobs and empty housing is like worlds that slow down your uh, your progress ultimately. Which is why when I when I take over new worlds, I just destroy everything that they had built on those planets. Reset it back to zero. How many months do I have until we're forced peace? Because I really want to get Karen Wall. Battling aggressor station. All right. We are good now on there and I'll, I'll fix up some of the other worlds as well i didn't realize no we didn't realize no that was uh yeah a thing. so if you if you scale at the top there's a symbol called empire size and mm -hmm. your empire size dictates your technology cost and tradition adoption cost so the bigger your empire size the Research slower you complete. adopt new tech and traditions and it's That's affected by pops colonies systems and districts so if you have tons of built-up districts on planets and you're not using those districts, you just slow down your your growth speed is that sort of Battling gotcha. Okay. Let me let me fix Not that of everything that. needs to be min-maxed, but it's just one easy way to to you know research fix things. complete. Oops. Let me get let me get some of those researches on there. Oh look, two world habitability. We we should get that, right? Yeah. Well, I, I think it's already fully habitable. Yeah, I'm surprised that's even a thing that we could get. Yeah, it seems like a. Uh, We're already a hundred percent. Is yeah. it getting better? All right, there. There's the piece. I think we did pretty well that there. I'm pretty happy with our results. Yeah, look at the amount of uh, that we absorbed, <laughs> like so much. We're freaking massive, dude. That's what we are. Only to grow even more. There's some border gore though that I don't like in the north because I wasn't finished consuming. So now I mean, we I'll, just have I'll to. out for now, but in ten years that's gonna change. <laughs> so you said that we unlocked a uh, wormhole. Yes. Okay. Wormhole There's a ton of wormholes wormhole. for us to to check. Because they were they those little jerks were flooding through the wormholes. So they must have that tech. Oh, we got a tomb world up here. I oh, will colonize that. Salvage preserved. Yeah. 
And there's a there's actually another one at uh, near the core at like ten o'clock. Uh, Zerak Zeranax Zeraniax. Construction complete. <laughs> I don't know these these words, it's bro. Crazy. I don't even try. I only speak butterfly, man. There we go. Yeah, I see it. Who wants to talk to us? Oh, interesting. I like oh, what's on the other side. Where to go? To the um. Uh, amoeba homeworld. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. All right. Let me give him the soft husk. Construction complete. We might already be husking. Uh, you know. Oh, I don't think I can. Uh... Yeah, well, they're busy. Yeah. Our busy little. Um... I, I show them as available, but I can't click over to it. It might be the. Uh... The way life is. Let's see how we're doing. One how of those we... desync things. Yeah, Salvage it is preserved. what it is. We'll be okay. <laughs> we have a governor that I need to rename. But his name is currently Seldom Leaks. <laughs> <laughs> well. <clears throat> I'm going to call him the diaper governor. <laughs> that's, like, that's just good. Seldom Leaks. <laughs> Literally named Seldom Leaks. That's ridiculous. Research uh. complete. So, Clegg, have we... No, nope, there's still one more person to eat at Clegg. Nom, nom, Clegg is nom. a world that's going to get destroyed. Okay. Ooh, greater sublight speeds with plasma thrusters. Done. Researching. Sounds good to me. Got stuff going on. We are good with money and stuff. All right, so let's reconfigure. Ships upgraded. The fact that you can balance the budget with like how absurdly large our fleets are is impressive. <laughs> it's it's we're, not been a real easy task, man. We've got what like we're doing. we got some big fleets for this early in the like really big fleets for this yeah. early in the game, and like we're paying for them. Somehow, I mean, I'm I'm glad I'm not the tax man, so uh, yeah, I just I get just, to use the fleets. I just cook all the books, really. <laughs> yeah. Construction. Complete. Another uh, research that might be good is Starhold. Yeah, I need to I need to pick up Starhold. There's just been some other things that have been not better. Oh, you're gonna have to recruit the new scientist because I can't recruit people right now. Oh. Oh. oh you're awkward. gonna have to also recruit the other. Uh, <laughs> our other Do you want to fix our de uh, our uh, desync then? Uh, Let's yeah. just do a quick desync fix. Okay. I'll just go back out and back in. Okay. That should fix. Well, welcome, Raiders. Yeah. We're, uh, I am co-streaming with Tristan here. You are also playing Stellaris, so uh, tell me about your stream while well, he rejoins. We are co-streaming co a um, Devouring Swarm where we're cooperative mode, so we're both playing the same Civ. And running into some bugs here and there, some desyncs, but it's been fun for the most part. It happens. All fun, a little frustration, but it's been pure fun too. <laughs> I waved at you guys just so you know when you came in, but you couldn't see me, but I did wave. <laughs> just want you to know that happened. All right. You need to re invite, or are you. Mm, oh, no, there you are. I think so. Yeah, yeah perfect. Yeah, we're playing with food. So we're 86 years in. We own about, I don't know, like a third of the galaxy. And we're growing. And we're hungry. Very hungry. Hungry little butterflies. 
Best quote from uh, the Fast and Furious original movie, We Hungry. Where the cuddle puff cloud. Little happy little butterflies. Okay, there it is. Thank you for tuning in to Stellaris Co-op Beta with Trustin, which originally streamed live on Twitch May 7th. If you have any feedback or questions for me, let me know in the comments below. If you'd like to catch a live stream of mine, Rodamont.com has my stream schedule and countdown timers to upcoming streams. If you'd like to join my gaming community, Rodamont.com also has a link to Discord, as does the description of this video. Thank you so very much for watching, and a special thank you to my Patreon patrons, Twitch subscribers, and viewers like you that support the channel and made it all the way to the credits. Thank you so very much. Hope to catch a next episode or upcoming stream. Farewell, my fellow Colorpuff.